Hey oh, oh Splinter Snake here with another box opening. Yeah, it has been, I don't know, freaking forever what it feels like. And I am ever so sorry for for the just sheer delay in my videos are coming. It's just ridiculous. Um I've been so busy with a lot going on in my life and I've started a new job. I don't know if you guys are aware of this. I did mention it on my Facebook, but my Facebook got a blocked. That's right, good old Facebook. They're ever so cool like that. I'm pretty sure I mentioned this in my previous video that basically what Facebook has done is they have said, Oh, your name is not actually Arrow Splinter Snake Arrow, so unfortunately we're going to have to block you so you cannot do anything until you can prove to us your real name. And I'm like, but I don't want to tell you my real name. My name's Old Splinter Snake O. Everyone knows me as Old Splinter Snake O. So why do you want me to tell you my real name? Can you please just put me back as Old Splinter Snake O? There's quite a few people out there that don't use their real name. Won't mention anyone, of course, in a YouTube video, Sean was Prime. But, you know... The <laughs> but they're picking on me. So I'm trying to get it reinstated. I'm trying to get back in there so I can do a lot more promotions and that in my Facebook. Because I do use my... Facebook to promote all my videos, where all my pictures are, all my previous videos, everything is there and now it's all gone and I'm really trying to get it back. In the meantime, this is so bad at time because literally, uh, like last month I did that competition. I know it's a little competition, just to say thank you back to you guys and thank you for your entries. I'm really appreciating everyone's like putting in their effort and giving their guesses. I did kind of stupidly give away the answers in the comments straight away, but I have deleted them previously. So I'm not actually replying to any of your your answers. You're going to have to find out when I do the roll, which will probably be maybe next week. So once again, I am ever so sorry for the massive delay. In the meantime, I have made up a temporary Facebook because I was waiting and 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 Facebook has basically still done nothing. They keep coming back to me saying, I've sent them my driver's license, I've sent them my birth certificate, I've sent them utility bills, and they keep coming up with really stupid excuses why they're not good enough. So I've now sent them as much information as I can, trying to get it back, and I'm probably going to have to come back with my original Facebook, but with my real name, so we shall see. I know it's not really into the world revealing my real name, but, you know, I kind of like that it was unique in that sense. We shall see, like I said. While on the mention of... Facebook and YouTube and what not you. I'd like to say a big massive thanks out to Turkish Figure Hunter. He's a supporter of mine and not really spoken to him before, but he's really leaving me some really decent and lovely comments. So I wanted to just give my hat off to you. Thank you. Because, um, you know, you've been a really decent guy and I really appreciate all your kind words you're saying. And I hope you like my future videos. In regards to my oncoming videos i'm hoping to get more done i've kind of as i said i started a new job and the job's been going it's taking up a lot of my time when i'm getting home i'm i've become that a little bit more addicted to my xbox um <laughs> gta is becoming a, a secret obsession of mine especially online i've not completed the story yet but i've made some good friends online and we're just having a great laugh playing on there and it's really making me and encouraged me to hopefully maybe start doing online videos. So I might have to actually invest into a capture device and then maybe start doing that. We shall see. But if they, I'll probably end up making another channel. I don't know. I don't know. That's there's, there's quite a far in the future. It's over there somewhere. Ignore what I just said. So back onto this. Now, as I've been away from YouTube for a bit, unfortunately I have opened a few parcels off camera. So I'd apologize. But this one came. And I thought, you know, I haven't done a video in a while. I really need to show something. And I'm pretty sure I know what's in this one. Thought I'd show you this bad boy right here. And then I got it and it was covered in a bin liner and had some brown tape around it. It had the address on it. And you know I don't like to show addresses. So I took the address off and then I saw this underneath. I was like, oh, that's got to be done. So, we got a puzzle. Is it was it jiggle? How do you pronounce that? Was jig? Was jig? Was gig? Was jiggy? Giggy. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm just messing around. Uh, but yeah, it's pretty cool. It's obviously not a puzzle. I'm not going to show you a puzzle in a figure review, am I? So, or a figure review channel. Well, as a lie, actually, I do show other stuff, don't I? So, we shall see. But no, I'm not a puzzle person, to be honest. Uh, I like mental puzzles, but not like sit there piece by piece puzzles. They, they kind of, nah. Just, they're, they're not from me. I don't like that. I've been doing my accents a lot more as well. It's weird. I think that's due to the, uh, Friends I've made online. Most of them are American. I think I've made one... In the last few weeks I've been playing GTA Online, I've made 
like a dozen American friends, like one UK friend, which is awesome. Um, and Crunk, if you're watching this video, which I very much doubt, shout out to you, bud. You're an awesome fella, and I love playing with you, man. You're just wicked. You always make me laugh, so thank you. Anyway, stalling a fly, let's get into this box, which you all are waiting to watch. The anticipation. I've probably already fast forward all that rambling back there, so you're now already to the end, so you know what's coming anyway, so. Spoiler! <laughs> okay, so. By looks of it, it's just like this part here will just lift off that. So let's cut through the set of tape. My tripod is quite far back, so. And I believe. That's what I need to do. I'll try to do sneaky. Yeah, okay, so I know exactly what's in here. So, shall we do this? We'll just we'll try and show you guys off camera, and then we'll put this here. Okay, so, a bubble wrap. How ah, joking. Newspaper. <laughs> Lots of newspaper. Oh, they look so cool. Uh, can you see that? Can you see that? See what that is? You know that, is? that looks really weird. That looks like that's really low at the box, but that's quite high. That little part there. Okay, so. Oh, we have some NECA, because you all know how I love NECA. NECA are awesome right now. We have some NECA gremlins, baby. Oh, look at this. Oh, I can't figure what their names are. Lenny. We have the NECA gremlin, Lenny. He looks very, very cool. Really stoked to have a close look at him. But we don't just have Lenny. We also have... George. I oh, don't forget George to stand. His feet are a bit more. And George comes with a little cigar. How cool is that? But we also have the Mugwai Lenny. And the Mugwai George. Yeah, there's going up. How cool is that? Oh, super soaked. That's it in that book. Oh, no, no. Oh, he's got their names. Look at that. Lenny. It's paperwork, basically. Oh, I did not expect in that. Oh, that's pretty cool. I've got to go for that paperwork in a bit and have a look at that. Collect them all. I'll keep that in the box so it's safe. So let's move this. So let's move these to the back. I've been toying with the idea of getting these Gremlins because, you know, I'm a big fan of the classic movies. They're just freaking awesome. If you've not seen the Gremlin movies, watch them. Just, just stop the video right now. Go and watch those movies. They're just so awesome. They're great for an 80s kid and they're just, they really are. Just, they always make me laugh, even to this day. I remember a couple of years ago, I watched them for the first time with my nieces, and well, my nieces and nephews watched them for the first time with me, and this is one part where a uh, gremlin jumps out, and of course, they were sitting on my lap, and I just went, Boo, like that, and made them absolutely just, like, jump to the sky, it was brilliant. They had a great time, they really loved it, and, you know, they're, they're kids that are, like, from the age of between, what are they, like, back then, they were, like, 11 was the oldest, and, how old was he, like, 7? Seven? 7 was the youngest, so they still enjoyed it, so it's good fun, you know. So, with regard to these, I got these off of eBay, and I paid, I got them two separate bids. There was this one, and there was this one. This one was for £21, and this one was for £21 for both of them. So that's pretty freaking awesome, if you ask me. And there's postage included, so that's pretty, I'm really chuffed at that. That's like £10.50 a figure. Mm, awesome. Okay, so the next one, I'm going to show you this one because I'm going to put it behind, probably. This arrived yesterday, so I probably should have kept it wrapped, but... I knew what it was, and it's killing me just keeping it in its packaging. So here we have a NECA Bioshock 2 Big Sister. Mm, I did tease a little picture about this figure that I was probably going to try and review it today, so that's probably not going to happen now. We shall see. I might do that when I get off of after this video. I don't know. But yeah. Boom. Mm, boom, boom, boom. I've not completed Bioshock 2. I'm about halfway through it, and the Big Sister is a pain in the backside because... She's a pain to kill. <laughs> it's just leapy and stuff, from what I remember. It's been a couple of years since I've played that game. Moving on. And I got this one. Now, I'm trying to remember if this was an eBay item or for my Facebook before I got blocked. I cannot remember. No, it was an eBay item, I remember now. So I got that one. Another Hunter. That will be my fourth 
One, two, I think either three or four, I can't remember. I can't see uh, back in my shelf, so. Also got this zombie, which comes with the zombie dog. I'm gonna put it this way. Ah, it's all falling, it's all burning now, just stay there. <laughs> The dog started. And then of course we have got another Spectre. This was a lot. The whole all four of these figures for sixteen pound and a penny. And then postage. And the postage is only five uh, so twenty one pound and a penny for them four figures. Freaking bargain. You guys know already how I feel about the Hunter. Awesome figure. Haven't done a review for Spectre yet, I keep meaning to do it, but you know I've got so many figures to review. I don't want to review this guy. This thing is freaking cool. I'm not a big fan. It's more of a statue than a figure, but it's got a really cool gimmick which I will show, and I do like it. The dog, on the other hand, is a bit blah, but still, it's very cool to have. And that it is it. And that is it, I guess. Well, one more thing I guess I can show you, which is not really figure related, but I've also got. Borderlands the prequel which I'm waiting to play but I'm trying to still finish Borderlands 2 so yeah I'm never sure I'm not ready to be honest I can't remember but still sitting here not opened it's so hard it's really <laughs> to sit on a figure uh, to sit on a figure or a game or something and not open it it's just like Ugh. <laughs> I honestly cannot get how you people that keep figures mint on card just just uh, how how your your willpower is amazing so I'm sitting on this, and the only reason it's still in its packaging probably is because I've had to go to work. Uh, <laughs> I got home from yesterday, opened it up, played Xbox, went to bed, went to work, and I'm like, I've been thinking about it all day, so that's pretty bad. Well, that's, that sounds really bad, doesn't it? But <laughs> So, yeah, big old thanks to the lovely old eBay of this one. Unfortunately, I can't give a shout-out to any of my friends or Facebook group, because, like I said at the start of the video, but there you go. Pretty sweet haulage right now. Cannot wait to get cracking on these bad boys and the girl and thing and thing. <laughs> and yeah, as usual, guys, thanks for watching. Once again, I'm apologizing for the massive delay. I will try and get these things coming out a bit more sooner, but keep collecting and I'm gonna catch you in my next one. Bye bye.